So whenever you use the Yaguchi, the snake mode, you know, as a base for a tie up and you start, you know, on the wrist, I always recommend to do another wrap up. Okay, some schools just do it like this and they go, you know, from the neck, whatever. Okay, I always recommend to tighten up the wrist, okay, to keep it really tight. Okay, so you have to go in the direction of the snake mode. Okay, if I go in the other direction, nothing happens. If you go in the direction of the snake mode, it gets tighter and tighter, you know, so the wrist is secure. You can go from the neck wherever you want to. So the same principle applies when you use the El Ganso. Okay, so we are here. If I'm now going this direction, nothing happens. If I go in the direction of the agancho, you see that, okay? The agancho will literally pierce the flesh, okay? So now you see these little grooves here, okay? They work like a kind of retention device. I use the rope and go over this, you see that? So now it's safe, it's secure. So now you go another time around, you're here, and then you can go, you know, for the neck, whatever. The thing is, whenever the person starts to move, the hook will go deeper and deeper inside the flesh. 